Good evening again. This is Crystal from Rocks or Rocks Across America. Um, tonight, I want to give you a little rundown on this self-adhesive stencil I found at the Dollar Tree. I've gone ahead and I've painted up a rock. Got a little nick in it, but for the demonstration, it will serve its purpose. So, I have undid one of these already to see what it would be like and it's a little different than I thought. I thought looking at it probably it was just going to be a sheet you held in place but it turns out that's not quite what it's all about. Let's see if I can even get it out of here. Okay here we go. So again it looks like a sheet like that but this is a peely and it's very sticky on the other side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose this butterfly and I'm going to cut it out and I'm going to stick it to that. Because uh, you don't want the edges lifting up. So let's do that. Try to be very careful not to ruin the other one. And I think we're fine here. And actually that's like a little rose or something. So here we got the butterfly and it should, let's see, fit quite nicely like that, I guess. Do we want it? Let me put it this way. There we go. That'll be perfect. Get it over here. Okay, so I'm going to take this off. If I can. It's a little tricky. No, it shouldn't be too bad. Here it comes. So, you probably want to have a little bit of a fingernail going. Here we go. Very sticky as you see. Woo Just like that. And my thoughts are get the paint on there and let it dry and then pull it off because I don't want to pull it off while it's wet so pretty much I've already ruined one of these yeah that can be hard on things so what do we want for a color here let's go with uh, purple I guess that should show up okay uh, a dark purple so Get some dark purple going. And I think this will take a couple coats. So. Just make sure I keep it inside the outline. I'm wondering what's going to happen if, you know, how I get when I have to dry everything with, with a hair dryer. I'll probably melt this little buzzard. And that would not be good for the video, now would it? I'm pretty sure you would say, that's a crazy lady from Maine. But probably wouldn't be the first time that's been said. I definitely think outside the box. And I think... I call it outside the box, but that's okay. I'm gonna go back to kindergarten and stay in the lines here. Because it's late at night too, and I'm this is my last little thing I'm doing, and I'm just trying to get it done so I can get the video uploaded for you because I've been so busy lately. And I got another one for you that I just did. Just so you can have some materials. Okay. I'm pretty sure I'm going to use my hair dryer because I'm not patient. Like I said. So let's just use that again tonight a little bit. Bear with me. We got a cop trying to take off over here. There we go. Sorry you're getting busy. Whacking the camera here. Okay, 
I did not want to get it uh, melted, so just want to be able to get a little bit more paint on there before I take it off. And I think that's okay. I didn't seem to do a lot of damage. Again, I guess I'm not so good at staying in the lines, but I know you have more patience probably. I'm always in a hurry to get to the next thing. But that's because I I'm pretty demanding on myself. I got a lot going on right now. Anyone ever wants to volunteer to help me? I would love that. I got so many things I need to start finding some volunteers. I d I don't expect you to move to Maine to volunteer, but yeah. This internet's a great thing. And trust me, you won't get bored. We do some pretty amazing things here in the Shiraj. I got some pretty amazing things happening right now. Okay. So let's try drying it again. Sorry, getting kind of bored here. Okay, so what do you think? What do you think? Should I pluck that baby off or let it have another coat? One more coat, I say. One more coat just to get a little bit more color on there. Just to get a little bit more color. There we go. This is hump day here. Making this video. And uh, it's been a pretty good week so far. We got our first snow here. And I'm happy to say it's almost gone. It's melted quite nicely. And it can melt right up to, to new, uh, Christmas Eve as far as I'm concerned. Uh, we do a lot of snowshoeing here. I should say they do a lot of snowshoeing here in my house. We live on quite a few acres here in Maine, and we have people come over and snowshoe. So if you're ever in the area, pop on in. I say this, there'll probably be 100 people showing up with snowshoes, but that's okay. I got coffee. Okay, so we are definitely going to make that the last coat. Plop that in the water. We're going to dry it some. Excuse me again. Thing. Think we can get that off there now? Let's try a corner. Yeah, we're gonna do it. There we are. Not sure if that's exactly what I thought it would look like, but hey, we know it's a butterfly, right? That's what the thing looks like. Um, I'm pretty sure. Probably can't use, well, you could probably use it again, but you would have to put like a Mod Podge on it, probably hold it in place, and then you'd be able to peel it off. I don't know what kind of mess that would make, but it might look like crystallized where this is. It may like really look nice, so who knows? I'm going to dry that a little bit. I 
I just don't know. Let's try a little bit of this stuff. Uh, yeah. I'm going to try a little bit of this stuff because even if it melts a little, that may look okay. One never knows. Let's see what it looks, see what kind of madness I can create here. Uh, not bad. Right here in the main she rod, you never know what we're doing, like I said. This is kind of pretty good. I mean, you could dress it up. And surely there is... There is uh, two more butterflies and some roses. This would be great for a young child. Just tape around the edges here so they can't go out of the lines like I did. And uh, it would be pretty fantastic. Well, let them go out of the lines. It doesn't really matter. Always the hair dryer. Always the hair dryer. Okay, I'm going to call it a night. We'll call this a Dollar Tree Butterfly. How's that? Okay, good night. Uh, this will need a few more coats just so you know, but you don't need to watch that happen. Bye-bye.